fur. Doesn't it look cold? <laughs> I'm telling you, it's crazy. It's uh, Monday early evening, like probably 6 p.m. around there. And the dogs were fed, and I thought I'd bring them out before it's too dark. But it's chilly. It's like in the 30s. And uh, I, I have one glove on. <laughs> one. Look how much darker my nails look now. That's the true color. Yeah, it looked like they were bright red. But they're not bright red. Anyway. It's Monday evening, and it's the start of a new week, and I just thought I'd say hello, hello. I hope wherever you are, it's nice and mild, hopefully, or if it's really cold and snowy and stuff, that you're into a, inside a nice, warm place with your favorite things Good to evening, do. Friends, family, RV Debs here. I'm making acorn squash. And I should have started by showing you the acorn squash. But anyway, I cleaned it out, cut it in half, put a little bit of water in the bottom of the glass dish that it's in. And it's cooking. So it's been already cooking nine minutes. I've got just part of an apple because the other part wasn't so good. So I just have a little bit of apple, a little bit of onion, pecans, and cheese and um, once the uh, acorn squash is soft I'm gonna scoop out some of the meat of it and mix it in I'm gonna saute as a matter of fact right now I forgot I was starting this and I'm gonna brown these Turn it down. Much better. Yeah, so I'm going to brown these, and when they get brown, then I'll put in the apples and the meat that I scoop out of the um, acorn squash. Anyway, I put the, uh, the, the onions were getting brown, so I put the apples in now. I'm going to cook them till they're soft. It'll just take a few minutes. I'm going to put some nutmeg in this. I've got a whole nutmeg. I'm going to scrape into it. And some herbs. So I think I'll put a little bit of herbs in it. Uh, the lady put in um, rosemary and sage. So, But she said you could use anything you have. Let me see what I want to use. Apples are soft. The onions are browned. Uh, these guys look really good. I'm going to scoop out some of their uh, insides and mix it all together and make, um, I'll show you, I'll make a stuffing and then put it back in. And I'm going to, I put in uh, rosemary and what else did I put in? Nutmeg and cinnamon, a little cinnamon. Okay, and I'm not going to add any sugar or anything. Let me get some other stuff together. Okay, and so I put uh, the scooped out, I just scooped them out as much as I could. Put them in a bowl with the onions and the uh, uh, cranberries and apples and some herbs. I'm going to put in pecans. Yummy. This is the stuffing. And last but not least, a half a cup of cheese. Let's mix this all together. Okay. And I'm going to put some in each one of these. Okay.
Yummy, yummy. Okay, so I've stuffed them and put them back in their little glass. I did take the water out this time. And let's just see how it comes out. Now, the lady said you could use raisins, you could use golden raisins, uh, cranberries, whatever you want. This is the way I like to cook. Whatever you have on hand is what you use. And um, she said you could top it with more cheese, but I'm not going to. As it is, it's got a lot of cheese. So half a cup of cheese. Okay, <laughs> that's it. Let me put it in the oven. And I don't have a real oven, so I'm going to put it in the microwave, unfortunately. But at home, you would use your oven because it would brown really nice. But it still it tastes real good. Okay, let's go. There it is. Took it Just took it out of the microwave. And it looks really yummy. Take a little taste. Okay. <laughs> Let me blow on it. Mmm. Delicious. Okay. Mm -hmm. Wow. Okay, I'm going to make some some uh, kohlrabi, it's called. Some greens, and that'll be dinner. Okay, so I've got my acorn squash there. My kohlrabi steaming and mushrooms with the uh, those exotic mushroom gravies that I made the other night. So I saved the water. And that's what I'm doing. I'm steaming it. So I'll be done in a little while. Nice, healthy, yummy dinner. And that's the uh, kohlrabi, I think it's called, and mushrooms. I've eaten a little bit of that. It's delicious. I'm so glad I made this. Because you have to be creative to enjoy, you know, having less meat. That kind of stuff. So you make everything special. And it's going to be a yummy dinner. Hope you enjoyed watching me. Well, tonight is leftover night, so I have the rest of the broccolini, the other acorn squash, but I put a little fresh cheese on it for something yummy, and a bag of the, um, it's it's called, I believe it's, it's Minute Made. I have the box. I'll have to bring it over, but anyway, it's um, quinoa and wild rice and brown rice. And I'm going to enjoy my dinner.